Hi guys. Here we are, it's Thursday night, and I have had just a crap week at work. And so I put my pajamas on, and I was just gonna go to bed and pull my covers over my head, and then I thought, why not go ahead and do this video? I had done a short earlier today and said I was gonna do a video. So I thought, why not just do this unboxing video? We're gonna try to make it as quick as we can. Um, this is a Friday night special. It is out of Tennessee. Um, you never know what you're gonna get, right? And Tennessee boxes aren't usually my favorite. So we're gonna see what we get out of this one. I also have my phone with me. Um, because I am in the middle of a Goodwill auction that ends in just about 18 minutes um, that I'm trying to win the lot. So I'm just going to kind of keep an eye on that at the beginning of this video also. I also have my little Marilyn Monroe lunchbox thing here. Um, and this is where I'm going to put um, all the sellable, sellable items that I'm going to keep in here. It just makes it easier for me to <clears throat> keep track of and get it into my inventory and put a price on so that's what we're doing for tonight so here we go we're just going to dig into this Tennessee box see what we find first impressions earlier weren't the greatest to be honest when I opened this up um, for the short but um, I don't know we'll see what we get hopefully we get lots of tangles because I need to relax there hasn't been much relaxation in my life this week at all. So hopefully we'll get some tangles and I'll be able to relax a little bit. Everybody knows I love the tangles, so. Ah, first up. Hmm. It's interesting. Not sure what these are. To be honest, they look like almost like coffee beans and they almost feel like coffee beans too kind of weird um i'm really trying to get to know my beads a little bit better so if anybody has any information they can pass on to me that'd be great i am watching a lot of videos and um, i did order um like a gemstone book so i can look through that i'm just trying to familiarize myself better with this kind of stuff but um the wear is pretty bad on these so these would probably go to craft. And here we just have some light silver, dark silver beads. Um, there is a tag, so I'll have to look at that a little closer later. Um, it's The wear's not bad, it's in pretty good shape. So we're going to put that over into our Maryland box for now. This um, has a spring ring clasp. I thought it was broken at first, but it's not. It's there. Um, this honestly feels like plastic to me, and I think that's probably what it is. It's kind of pretty, oh, there's a feather. It's kind of pretty, I don't know, I'm gonna put that in the maybe pile for now. This is a gold tone. It's really super dirty. That could be some really bad wear. I got kind of nighttime lights on in here right now, so it's kind of hard to tell. Um, so we'll put that over in the maybe as well. Let's see what we got next. Looks like a single earring. It's kind of caught up and all the other stuff. Yeah, single earring. Another single earring as well. Don't get a lot of um, doubles out of most of these boxes. I usually buy two boxes, honestly, and it'll usually make a, <laughs> a few pairs for us. But um, I decided I was only going to buy one box this week. I, I've been a little 
less than excited about these boxes lately, so I just didn't want to get two. Plus, they changed their delivery, so now it's $7 per box instead of just $7 flat shipping. And so I took the other box back out of my cart and left it behind. Um, this is kind of cool looking. Um, probably Howlite, I'm sure. Um, but this clasp is a little older type of lobster clasp. So I'll probably... Oh, and it is signed as well. So we'll take a second look at that. Definitely 100% plastic on this one. Looks like there might be a few, yeah, a few shells as well. Um, some gold tone. Mm. I do like the sound. I'm all about these sounds for sure. Um, I'll put that in maybe. Red seed bead necklace. Um, let me just get this one out. This will be an easy one to get out. Quite a few seed beads on this one. I have been taking apart a few of the things just to sell um, the beads and such to people if they want to make their own creations out of them. So that might be something that I choose to do with this. I am going to run a few of these things by Sherry. Of course, she's not here tonight. You know, I love to have Sherry around because she's just um, vast knowledge for me. But um, I might run a few of these items by her that I put over in the maybe pile. Another single earring. Unfortunately, it's got a, quite a bit of verdigris on it. It's kind of a cute earring, but lots of verdigris. Bengals. Bengals more bangles. I've been getting a couple, a few of these lately. I really like these bangles. They're like a really thin metal. Um, looks like this one has all of its, mm, yep, oh, it's just turned around. Looks like it has all of its gemstones in it. So this one I really like a lot. I'll probably clean it up and uh, we will put that with the other ones that I've gotten like this is too. I think this is my third one. So that's pretty cool. I've been so bad. I haven't really gotten rid of... <laughs> oh wait, here's another one. I haven't really gotten rid of any of my jewelry that I've gotten. I swear I probably have about 100 pounds of jewelry in this house right now. Driving my husband crazy. So I have to get serious about going through some more of it and um, donating and craft jars and selling and all that good stuff. Um, a few bangles. This one has some arrows on it. It's a cuff bracelet regular bangle. This one, not an Alex Anani, but it's an Alex Anani type. It just has the planet on it here. So I don't really do a lot with the bangles, really. Oh, we all know I, how much I love these little tassels. Ugh. I don't know what it is about a tassel that I don't like, but I just don't like them. Another single earring. Oh, I better check on my auction and go ahead and place my bid. Ends in 14 minutes. Nobody's bid on it. I'm pretty excited about that. I usually try to wait. One quick second, guys. I'll be right there. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and place my bid. Wish me luck. Right now I'm the highest bidder because I'm the only bidder. Um, so anyway, let's keep untangling here. Hopefully I continue to be the only bidder. That's what I'm hoping anyway. Oh, here's another one of those older lobster clasps. Tiny one, a real tiny lobster clasp. That's kind of strange for um, a necklace this size. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's uh, 
super, super tiny lobster clasp. So this is just a um, beaded necklace. Looks like um, plastic beads. There's a few metal beads as well. I do like the colors. It's very fall-y. So we'll put that in the maybes. Told you guys I hate to let go of anything. <laughs> but I am finding that I have to, so we're... I'm getting through it. I've been going through it, and I've got like four boxes right now for donation and craft, so we're getting there. Just keep working on it. Got excited when I first started doing this about a month ago and just started really ordering a bunch of jewelry, so I probably should have slowed my roll a little bit, but I just like seeing what you get. This one, oh, this is all one. I thought this was two. Oh no, it is two separate. Okay, good. I think. I think, I think. Yep, there it is. So, I don't like a lot of things that are on any type of um, leather or string or anything like that. It's usually not my vibe, but um, this one I do like these beads. Um, they are cold to the touch, so I believe these are glass beads. I like the color. The blue color of the beads is really pretty. So I would definitely take this apart and do something else with the beads for sure. Yeah, a bit of a tangle going on. It's just two items, but they are really super tangled up. So let me get this class done. Another lobster clasp. So this one is just a regular lobster, not very old at all. Um, looks like an interesting piece though. I kind of like it. So it's got some clusters of things going on. So let's take a look at it. Just gonna do it back up real quick. Let's see. It's not a signed piece. Um, I do like this chain. I think that's what I actually like the best about it. Um, got a lot going on though. Uh, so I think this is gonna go in the maybe. It's pretty long. It's got some pretty aspects to it. Um, yeah, that's gonna go in the maybe pile. And here's another one of those necklaces. I would definitely take this apart, I think, and make it into something else myself, or maybe sell the bead bag. So we'll put those over there by themselves. This is only a five pound box, so it shouldn't take too, too long to get through. Not been, um, I've not had the guts to be like other YouTubers that I watch and order those 20 pound, 30 pound boxes. I just don't know what I would do. I would be so overwhelmed. So this is a single earring. It's very pretty. So hopefully maybe we'll see the mate to that. Right now we've got five singles, no mates. So that's usually how it goes. Another single. All by its little lonesome. Little painter's palette. Another single. Getting up there in singles, guys. Oh, another one of those bracelets. Oh, they are a signed piece. Very interesting. So the three of them must go together. And it is a signed piece, so we are going to check this out just a little closer today. Because I really do like these. I've liked them before, but I've only gotten single ones in the boxes before. Oh, I've got two other singles around here. They're different though. They've got like purple gemstones in them. And these have 
like a smoky gray. So that's really pretty. I like those a lot. Uh, very short little chunky necklace. And it is in good shape. Appears to be no real signs of wear. So that's a cute piece. I like it. Let's see what this looks like. It's very short and chunky. I'm not used to them being so short and chunky, but I do like it. That's crazy because normally I don't like anything this big, but this I like. So that would be a yes. A yes for me. Keeping that piece. Uh, there's some tangles here. Oh, that came out very easy. Like it. Sort of. <laughs> Another single earring. Love those beads. Maybe we'll find that one. That would be beautiful. This is just a gold um, three layer chain. Lobster clasp. Just, it's pretty plain. Um, not a lot of wear. It's kind of dirty. Needs a little cleaning. But not bad. So one more check on this auction, you guys, because it's about to end. See what happens. Still the... I'm still the high bidder, and it only has one minute, 55 seconds left, so it looks like I'll probably get that one, but I'm going to keep a little bit of an eye on it. You never know when somebody's going to rush in at the last second. Nobody was watching it but me, though, so the chances of that happening are pretty slim. Um, hmm. Okay. Lobster clasp. Let me start with the clasps. I don't I just start with that in my descriptions. Um, hmm, not loving the look or the feel of it. As a matter of fact, this clasp isn't wanting to work for me. Let's see. Try it one more time here. There it goes. Um, lots of jump rings. Just a lot going on on this. And it's really super light weight. Um, uh, this is gonna have to go in the maybe pile till I make a decision. I don't like jewelry that's put together with jump rings. I don't know why. There's just something about it that I don't like the look of it. But we'll put it in the maybe pile for now. I'll just give it a quick second glance and we'll see. Wow, wow. Now that's a clip earring. Wow. <laughs> it's not heavy. It's pretty light, but look how big that is. Imagine the ear that wore that. Um, here's a pair <laughs> of homemade earrings. <laughs> They're kind of cute, but not anything that I would deal in, so that'll go to craft. Auction ended and I won it. Perfect. That's great. All right. Another single earring. Oh, this is pretty. It's going to take me a minute to figure it out, but I really like these. They're tangled amongst themselves. Oh, it's super, super. Okay, Tennessee, you might be making me a little happy this time, except for... <sighs> Looks like there was a clasp at one time. But now there is, there's not. I'm not sure, but let me show you how pretty this is. Um, 
Then I'll figure out the mystery later. But I love, 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 love the colors. They're so sparkly and so beautiful and very fall. Um, super pretty, but like I said, it looks like there used to be a clasp of some sort. And I see it nowhere, so we'll have to work that over again. I'm just going to set that aside because that's, that's really pretty, so if I can save it, I'd love to. Um, oh, here's a pair of earrings. The only reason why it's a pair is because I put them together. So they're both there. Very chunky gold hoops. Wear is really good on them, so I would definitely sell these. Those are super, super cute. Earrings are my favorite thing. I really love earrings a lot, so I'm happy when I get pairs. Um, this is a pendant. It's pretty. I don't know if there's a chain in the box. We'll see. And it looks like there is a signature on the back, so... I might set some of these aside. Maybe if we have time, we might look. See who they're signed by. A couple more bangles. A little different. I do like the yellow enamel on this one. And the wear is really good on it. That one's a really cute one. And this is just a braided, plain gold bangle. Single earring. Single earring. And single earring. Another single earring. Wow, that's pretty big too. Put that over there by the gold big, big guy. Um... Plain gold flat necklace. It's kind of pretty. Not a lot of wear. I would say definitely a vintage piece. Not signed. Let's see how it looks on the neck. I think it's kind of pretty though. Definitely not something you see much of now, but I kind of like it, so we're going to put that in our maybe pile, and maybe pile's getting pretty big. So hopefully all of you are having a better week than I am. I've had a really, really crappy week at work. Things just aren't going well for me. It seems like everything that I do, I'm running into brick walls, so it's been just a really bad week. So hopefully you all are having a better week than me. So we've got just some faux pearls. Uh, the clasp is broken, so that will go to craft. Oh, it's got a hitchhiker. I was about to say, why is that there? Um, single earring. Square. That's different. This, not for me. Um, it's, a uh, leather, no clasp, and just this knot of metal at the bottom. Let's see what it looks like on the neck. Maybe I'll change my mind. I highly doubt it, but let's see what we can do. Yeah, see, I'm, I'm not a big fan of how these lay. Um, it's okay, it's gray. Yeah, that's probably going to be a pass for me. Hmm. Made in China. It doesn't surprise me. Um, just a plain silver bracelet. It's pretty banged up, so um, that's nothing that's going to come off. So I think I'll go to craft as well. Another single earring, red enamel. A um, couple of single earrings that are really stuck together, so I'm not going to bother taking them apart unless I see their mates, but these two are really badly stuck together. More and more singles. Okay, this appears 
to be thinking maybe an anklet. It's too big to be a bracelet. It could be maybe a really small <clears throat> 14 inch necklace, kind of like the one that I have that's a vintage um, Avon cameo piece. So I'll have to look into this a little further, but it's kind of pretty. I like the colors. That's what I think is catching me, are the colors. Catching my eye with those colors. Um, <clears throat> hmm. Another single earring that's really, really stuck. I don't know that I'm going to be able to work that out without damaging anything. So I'm going to work on that. It's a clip. Um, but it's stuck to this really cute fish bracelet. So I will work it out and get it out of there. But this bracelet is super, super cute. I like that. The, the, um, it looks like abalone to me, but I don't know. I mean, I'll have to look at it a little closer, but it's super pretty. I like it. So we'll set that aside to give an extra look. Oh, feathers. Nope. I don't do feathers, guys. All the feathers get thrown away. I think it's very blech, unsanitary. So that'll go to the garbage right away. There are certain things I will not hang on to. <laughs> um, single screw back earring. I do love the screw backs. 